guys and welcome back to another video with me. My name is Danny, and if you're new to my channel, I like to do health, fitness and well-being content as well as some vlogs and some planner videos. But for today's video, as you can see from the title, I want to talk about some of my goals for 2022. Uh, as it is the new year, I just thought it'd be nice to share some of my goals with you guys, um, see if you guys have anything similar to my own and I guess just share really. Um, now, in my last video, I did talk about five top tips to help keep you motivated with your health and fitness. But the top tips that I spoke about in that video can definitely be used in setting your goals for any area of your life. And that is exactly what I'll be doing with the five goals that I'm going to share with you guys today. So without further ado, let's just get sharing, shall we? Okay, so goal number one, and I feel like a lot of people do have this goal, especially those, well, it is for those that are starting out on YouTube, and that is to hit 1,000 subscribers. Now, um, <laughs> there's more to it than just hitting 1,000 subscribers for me. Now, yes, that is great. That would be a great number to achieve, but the the big thing about wanting to hit that goal is to know that I'm making meaningful content, that I'm making content that people want to watch, to listen to, that people want to know my thoughts on things or see what it is that I'm doing with my life, whatever. I just want to know that I'm possibly making a difference, that I'm having an impact, I don't know. <laughs> um, and unfortunately, the only way to know that through YouTube is to have the subscriber count. So yes, 1000 subscribers is my first goal in terms of numbers, <laughs> but underneath it all, the thing for that is that knowing, as I say, that the content I'm making is having an impact on you guys watching and that you are enjoying it. And who knows, I might really have an impact on people and make a difference. And that's the thing that really gets me more excited to know is that I'm just, I don't know, reaching out to as many people as I can. I do like to help people. I do like to cheer people up. So that is my goal overall with that. But in terms of numbers, yes, 1000 subscribers would be my, would be a dream. So that would be goal number one. Okay, number two, complete a whole year with my planner. So if you guys have seen my planner videos, especially the ones that I released at the start of, no, end of last year now, I think they came out, but with my new planner, my Periwinkle planner, my goal is to achieve the whole year with one because I didn't do very well last year, got about halfway through and then fell off the wagon. So that is second goal of this year because I know if I stick to using my planner, it will definitely help with number one's goal of making that happen because I'm going to be able to create a schedule. I'm going to be able to stick to it. I'm going to plan in my videos. I'm going to be able to take notes of any ideas that I have. So I just need to make sure I keep it with me at all times in order to have these things happen, I guess. <laughs> so yes, I want to complete a whole year because I know that I will benefit from having a scheduled life almost, I guess, or at least a scheduled work pattern, work, whatever, routine, because it's important because I want to achieve that 1000 subscribers. So if I don't plan it and I don't prepare myself, I'm not going to do it because I'm not going to be creating the content and getting it out there. So a year with my planet is goal number two. Okay, goal number three woo, is actually a goal that I achieved last year in 2021. And I want to do it again this year. So that is now I do have an Apple Watch and I want to hit all 12 monthly challenges that it set for me. Now, as I say, last year was the first year that I actually did it. I did the whole 12 months. It felt great. I literally got my last award on December the 31st. I think it was about 5 p.m., 6 p.m. when it flashed and was like, you've done it. And it felt great because I'm, a, I'm someone that does like a challenge. I do like to challenge myself. And the beauty of this, the Apple challenge, is that you don't know what it's going to be until the month starts. So you can't really prepare yourself, which I quite like because sometimes the unknown can be quite, I guess, exciting. It can be an extra challenge. So I want to make sure I can do that again this year because I know that I've benefited it health and fitness wise. It's it's there to keep me healthy. It's there to help keep me healthy and keeping fit and healthy is a big importance to me. I do want to make sure I keep fit and keep strong and keep my bones healthy, etc. So 
having these challenges on top of what I already do with my workout schedule, etc. It's just nice. It's just nice to have that extra little thing. So goal number three is to hit all 12 of my awards because it just looks nice as well when you look back through and you see them all there. Oh, it's just satisfying. So goal number three, hit all 12. Number four, I was going to do that. That's eight. Four. <laughs> get better at editing and recording. Now I am very much still a newbie. It's only been a year. If you can say a year. <laughs> um, as much as I did hit my goal last year of 30 videos before I was 30, I didn't have a consistent scheduling and etc. So I didn't really have time to develop my recording skills or my editing skills. Now I have slowly started updating my equipment, getting new things. So I do have a ring light now. I did buy myself some new editing software uh, just after Christmas. So I am still very, very new to using it and figuring out how it all works, all the additions, because I've been using iMovie for the past year. So now having software that I can add annotations and animations and all sorts of things, I don't know what I'm doing. I was never an IT student. I didn't do IT at school. I didn't do any videography classes or editing classes or anything like that. Um, yes, I was a creative student, uh, but that was more in terms of textiles and art and graphics, but not this side. And graphics, I will bring it back to that because a lot of people out there are like, well, you can use graphics in IT. No, I did like drawing graphics. I didn't do computer graphics, so different. Um, <laughs> so editing and recording is still a whole new world to me, but I do want to get better. So I'm going to study new techniques. I'm going to do my research. I'm going to learn things. I'm just going to trial and error because it might work, it might not. And during that process, I'm going to continue not worrying too much about how it looks. I mean, obviously I'm going to be concerned to an extent, but I don't want to get too wrapped up with it not being perfect because as I've said in previous videos, my perfect is different to your guys' perfect. So as long as I think it looks okay, I'm just going to keep going. And yes, I will take feedback. So please be nice, but do give me critical feedback, but be nice about it. Um, I know that one of my videos that recently went up, the <laughs> exposure was terrible. I couldn't figure it out. I really, really tried. I spent hours trying to figure it out and it was terrible couldn't do it but I figured it out now but I didn't want to re-upload that video because it took me too long to get it up there anyway but it was a learning process it was part of it um so yes my next goal is to get better at doing it all I guess <laughs> recording and editing scheduling as well I should probably put that in there too and lastly goal number five got a very quick video for you guys today for sure um I want to have another stream of income I mean I think everyone would like another stream of income, right? <laughs> and I'm not an exception to that. I would like to have another way of bringing money into our house. Uh, with saying that as well, the house, we have big ideas for our house. We still have lots and lots to decorate and redo, rejig. We want to build an extension, all sorts of stuff. So having an extra stream of income would mean that we'll be able to do those things. So I don't know how I'm going to do that. It could be YouTube. It might not be. It might be something else. But this year, I do want to try and focus on figuring out a new way or another way of bringing in some income, whatever. Um, because we, as I say, do have big, big goals for this house and we want to get them done as soon as we can. And as soon as that's done, then we can just enjoy life a bit more, go out a bit more, go on adventures. Hopefully, I don't want to say it, but once things get a little bit more ease around the world in the current situation, we do want to be able to go out and see more of the world again and do more things. So having that income will mean that we can do it without so much worry because we'll know that all bills are paid off and the house is in a situation that we are happy with, etc. So yeah, I want to work on having another stream of income. So again, having my planner there would be useful and just taking the opportunities when I see them and just grabbing them and going, yes, I'm going to go for it and just do it. And blah. last year was very much my first year of just doing it. And I did it, at least the things I wanted to do, most of the things I wanted to do. I can't remember. Definitely the big one of getting the YouTube stars and just doing it. So that is a big tick off my bucket list. So I want to continue that into 2022 and just keep on going and not let the current situation keep bothering me and getting in my way being aware of it obviously because we have to be nice and safe 
but just going and taking those opportunities when I see them. So hopefully you guys will do the same. Okay, that was the, well, the, <laughs> that was my five goals for 2022. I do have a lot of little goals, I guess, but those are the biggest ones for this year. Now, some of them might run over, for example, another stream of income. It might not happen this year, it might happen next year, but it's going to be the, one of the things I'll focus on now because it might be that this year is the year to lay the groundwork and then next year will be the year that it actually happens. And it could be the same with a lot of these other goals as well. So have those goals, guys. And if they don't happen this year, but you know you've worked on them, they might happen next year, they might happen the year after, but you've just got to be consistent. If it's something you really, really want, keep on working at it. It's, it's, the, it's something I'm learning. I'm still learning to do it and I'm trying to keep myself in that mentality of if I keep working on it now, it's going to pay off. I'm going to be successful in what I want to achieve and it's going to happen. So do keep on giving it a go. And I'd love to hear what some of your guys' goals are this year. Not so much the resolutions because I feel like they're slightly different or can be slightly different. Maybe they are the same, but usually people perceive them slightly differently. So what's your goals? What would you like to achieve? Even if it's not this year, what do you want to achieve? Let me know. Put a comment in the comments below. And let me know if you guys have similar ones to me as well, because it'd be nice to know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and if there's any other video ideas that you want me to do, please again, leave a comment down below. I'll happily look through them. I do also try and reply to every comment that I get on my videos. Um, it's really nice to hear from you guys. So please do keep on doing that. And yes, as always, please like, comment and subscribe to my channel if you're new. Please help me get to that 1000 subscribers for sure. I hate begging. I don't want to beg. I don't think this is begging, but it would just be nice if you did want to click subscribe. Just, just click the button <laughs> and just help me at least achieve one of those goals for this year. And I will hope, well, I will constantly keep, bring out content and hopefully keep entertaining in any way that I can. And helping in any way I can. That's the, the biggest goal with my channel. I have started the year off a lot better with that and planning my videos. So just like, comment and subscribe to see what comes out next. <laughs> okay then guys, until my next video, have a lovely day and I'll see you later.